What is going on my people? How is everybody doing and how is everybody failing? And today my people, welcome back to another video. And in today's video, I got a special player build for you all today. This is one of my favorite point guards. This man was a great player, great score, great facilitator. I'm into the point guards that facilitate. I like the Rondos of the world, the Andre Millers, the CP3s, the Ricky Rubios, you know, those type of players, my style when it comes to playing point guard and being a fan of the point guard. So as you can see, right, two-way slashing playmaker, right, Andre Miller. So as you can see, he has an 85 driving layup, which is amazing. And then he has that 80 close shot. We'll probably go 85 just so we can get that fast switch. Not much of a shooter, but as you can see, we have that mid-range at a 79 with a three-point shot of a 62. Not bad at all. He's a great free throw shooter, so this build is gonna be able to go to the wreck and hit the free throws. As you can see, the playmaking is amazing. So we get the pass accuracy of an 88. Ball handling is a 90, and speed with ball is an 84, which is amazing. You cannot go wrong with the build. As you can see, the defense is pretty solid as well. 81 perimeter, 90 still, which is great, and we get some decent offense and defensive rebound. When we go to the physicals, we see that he has an 84 speed, 84 acceleration, that's really good, 60 vert, 88 stamina. His build is looking amazing. So let's just go to the badges. I feel like the badges are important because it's gonna show you. He has bully, my people. He has bully on silver. So we, we need to up the weight so we can at least get bully on silver. No shooting. He wasn't known for a shooter, but the playmaking, you see break, start a dime, floor, general, needle thread. I mean, this is my type of playmaking point guard type of build right here the fact that he has bully on silver is amazing now he only has glove on gold so we already know what type of build this is gonna be so you know he's 180 we gotta get that bully at least on silver so let's go into the my player builder and make the one and only andre miller all right my people so as you can see right first and last name andre miller point guard right hand jersey number is 24 we're gonna go 6'4 218 pounds and then i would just go compact because you know you don't want to look that big but i think it would be good to max out the wingspan 218 64 so we can at least get that um silver bully all right with this build right we looked at the attributes we saw what he had he had an 80 shot close but we're going 85 just so we could get that fast twitch by going 85 we also get a uh, giant slayer on uh hall of fame and we get the fearless on gold that's going to be really good for a build like this my people this is going to be a very versatile build uh you know, so we're just gonna do that, right? Then he had an 85 on the lip, so we're going 85, all right? That's all we're gonna do. Unfortunately, we only have 12, but you know, it is what it is, all right? For the mid-range shot, we're going 79, all right? We're going 79 on the mid-range shot, and then we're just gonna go 65 on the three-point shot, and then we're gonna go up to an 85 on the free throw, all right? That's gonna give us 13. Now, he had an 88 on the passing, so we're gonna go 88 right the ball handling was a 90 so we're gonna go 90 right here and then the speed with the ball we're gonna go all the way up to an 86 on the speed with the ball my people that's gonna give us 27 so this is gonna be a um playmaking type of build you have to know how to use this build properly if not you're gonna probably get all right so we're gonna go 50 on the interior we're gonna go all the way up to about 86 my people we're going 86 all right you already know we're going all the way up to a 90 on the steel uh he didn't have block so we're just gonna leave that the offensive rebound we're just gonna go 50 50 actually let's go 60 and 60 right here speed we're gonna go all the way up to an 85 on the speed and go 85 acceleration then we're gonna max out that strength okay as you can see that's gonna give us that silver bully right here let's go all the way up so just so i can show you guys that silver bully okay that's gonna be very important to have the silver bully because that's what he had all right and he had a lot of the playmaking badges as well. So we're gonna definitely make sure that he gets that. And now we're gonna go up to the stamina. He had an 88, but we're just gonna go 90 for the stamina. Or uh, the vert, he had a 60. So now what we can do is when it comes to the shooting, let's just, no, let's just leave it. Cause that's, we're making Andre Miller, okay? We're just gonna leave that. And then we, we, we could just go up 87 here. And then we could probably put the rest 
without changing the name and anything else, we'll probably just go 80. We'll probably go 52 here, all right? So 12, 13, 27, and 21. This is looking like the orange and red when it comes to the pie charts, you know what I mean? So. This is looking like an amazing build, as you can see. This is gonna be a good build. It's gonna be able to clamp up. You're gonna be able to play make. You're not gonna probably be able to hit open threes, but you do get 13 um, shooting badge points. So I'm sure if you wide open, if you have a good shot, if you time it great, you'll really be good. This to an 84, so okay, so we don't get fast. Okay, cool. So we're not gonna get the fast twitch on gold, but at least we get it on silver. I think this is a lot better because he had gold glove. This is what we want. We want that gold glove. So this is the build right here, right? This is going to be the build. And then the rest, we can just put 50 interior, all right? So this is looking like an amazing two-way slashing build, all right? So what I'm thinking, of course, I'm going team rating boost and perimeter badge drop. This is what I would do. Y'all can switch it up, but this is the build right here, the Andre Miller build, as you can see. Some interesting people when it comes to the shades of, but yes, this is his uh, build, the two-way slash and playmaker. So we're gonna test this build right now. This is a great point guard build. I would love to have made this build because this is my type of build right here. Great defense, playmake, you know, a little bit of shooting, but I wanna facilitate. So we only get 11, so, of course, Giant Slayer right here, uh, we need that bully, you know what I mean? We need to get that bully, but like I said, we don't have enough badge points, unfortunately, right? So, yeah, we're gonna have to put, so look, the only way that we'll be able to get this aqua, I mean, get the bully is, let me see. Me personally, I will put all my uh, badge points to this, honestly. I will put my badge points to this, and you'll be able to get it, all right? But just to continue with this this video, let's just core this, and then, um, you know what I mean? Because that bully is what we want, you know? We have to get bully. That just, it doesn't make sense if we don't get bully. All right, so now the shooting, you know, you want to get Claymore, core green machine, you could get your catch and shoot, you could do volume shooter. I feel like you'll be able to hit consistently, honestly. You know, you'll be able to hit consistently and then I'll just go, you know, clutch shooter right here. But you could hit consistently with the uh, shooting percentage that, that you have for the mid-range. 65-3 is not the best, but wide open, I'm sure you'll be able to knock it down. Now the playmaking, very important, all right? We, we get quick first step on Hall of Fame, which is amazing. Of course, we want that pluggable, right? Now we want to core this, get the handles for days, and you could get here, right? You could do something like this. This would be incredible. But for me, because I don't dribble like that, I'm gonna go at least bail out here. And then, of course, I need my needle threader. Hyperdrive is another good one you can, but for me, I don't dribble like that, you know? So I don't really care to do all of that extra stuff. Vice grip helps with, with a lot of stuff and definitely some break starters. So th this is how I would do it, you know? I'm, I'm not really a dribbling type of person, so I don't really care to have handles for days and all these other stuff. But if you are, then you could do that. Now, for the defense, I'm just gonna get the ones that I feel like will definitely help me out. Chase down, workhorse, at least we could get that hit, and then at least bronze. So we get all of this right here, my people. But of course, what I'm thinking, it's gonna be most likely quicker to probably get the interceptor, so then I'm gonna go boom. Uh, we could probably bring this down like that, and then, let me see. You just go something like this, but, yeah, y'all let me know what y'all thought about this build, and until next time, much love.